Hey guys, how are you doing? Welcome to Future Trend Today. Um, I just wanted to take this moment to thank you guys first and foremost for tuning in um, and watching the first three parts of my conversation with Lee. Um, if you haven't already, they are there. Uh, you can definitely check them on my channel as well. Um, for everyone that has been redirected to my channel as a result of Lee's retweets, I appreciate you guys. And uh, to Lee, if you're listening to this, I really appreciate appreciate your time. Um, and sharing your thoughts on the topics that we discussed but this one is a hot topic i i wanted to throw this one in there to see what lee thought on uh pretty much the whole xrp being backed by gold and qfs so um if there's any day to make it happen i guess it's tomorrow and we'll find out what this week has to offer but i um i really appreciate you guys and once more if you're looking to to chat or you know just communicate further you can also follow or chat with me on twitter um, as i'm active on that and trying to grow my account there as well so i really appreciate you guys once more and um yeah i'll do my best to continue to follow up with some good content moving forward but um don't forget to like comment subscribe and also hit that notification bell for any time i make a post and um i hope you guys enjoy this segment or this bonus video and i'll meet you guys on the next one all right have a good week um no, Lee, thank you so much. I um I just wanted to get a get a, a take from you. Well, actually <laughs> I was asked to ask you this question. What are your thoughts on the uh the recent YouTube sensation who's been mentioning something about gold backed XRP? Oh, don't start me on that. <laughs> you're gonna get me angry. Um first word, um bullshit. The geezer has <laughs> got a clue. Um <laughs> I'm oh, sorry, man. but XRP cannot be backed by gold. Mm. It just cannot. Right. If anybody understands what backing is, yeah. it cannot be backed because it becomes an issuance point, right? Yeah. The, the tech, um, it would be a it would be a security, wouldn't that be? Wouldn't that exactly. put as a security? <laughs> exactly. Right. So it doesn't make sense, right? Right. Right. Could it be pegged to gold? Possibly, but do mm. I think that will happen? No. Right. Terminology is um, everything. Exactly. And it's not understanding because it's a misinterpretation within the industry what backing and pegging it is. Right. Right. And they're two completely different things, obviously, right? Investopedia, uh, everybody, in case you're wanting to find uh, the differences, you can always check <laughs> Investopedia. <laughs> exactly. Research, do your own research, as we always encourage, right? Exactly. And then, and then he talks about, um, then he talks about that the new quantum financial system is going to be starting on the 1st of September 2020. Absolute yeah. bollocks. And my, my whiskers went um, up on that one, but I, uh, yeah, <laughs> I wanted to it, see what you thought. It is, it's, going to, it's going to be a coexistent stage, and I've proved this through my research. Right. Um, that there will be a coexistent stage. Um, do I think central banks' digital currencies will be gold backed? That's what, potentially. It's a possibility. Yeah. And I think if I'd have to put my neck on and call it, I would say, yeah. I think that makes more sense from a, from a technical standpoint than anything, because you can't magically back XRP secretly to something and it not be affected immediately. Like technically speaking, whatever elements would affect a protocol or whatever elements would affect a particular technology would be baked into the beginning or the foundation of that technology from the beginning. It wouldn't be something that would be surprised. Like we, we had no idea this was going to happen. So it therefore makes sense. The ripple has been pretty open about this from the beginning, actually. And, that, and just to get everybody's understanding here, ripple didn't actually make XRP. They were gifted XRP. There's a whole conversation on where that actually came from. I'm, I'm hoping to get your take on it, maybe some other time, but um, I think if anything, XRP would be something that, as they're mentioning, bridges all of these CBDCs and everything in between, being that we're, I guess, beckoning on a tokenized life very soon here. I have no idea. I might be able to exactly. tokenize my cup that I'm drinking out of today, too. But we'll, exactly. we'll see. Best I think that makes more sense. Oh, oh, totally, totally, totally. And uh, we'll, we'll have a discussion another time and we'll, and we'll, um, and, and we'll take this to, to another discussion point and we'll kind of drill into some of these points as well. Right, right. Um, 
But um, great initial discussion. Anyway, it was an absolute yeah. pleasure meeting you. So thank yeah. you for your time today. No, no, thank you for your time, Lee. I was actually going to close it off because I know you probably have either a football game to catch up on or a family to, to, to have dinner with. So um, thank, you. thank you so much for your time. I really appreciate it.